Sonic says, there's no such thing as ethical consumption under capitalism. Whoa! Uh. Sonic says prison labor is slave labor. <laughs> Stay woke, kids. Quick, Damien, what does AF stand for? As friends. We are bored as friends together. Bored yeah. as yeah. friends. Welcome back, everybody. We are playing a game called Gloom today, which is why we're all freaking dressed up. It's dope. Everybody show off your outfits. You guys mm. dressed up? There you go. Let's talk about Gloom, shall we? Ooh, gloom. It's my favorite salt and pepper song. Let's talk about Gloom, <laughs> baby. Let's talk about... Uh, What's dysentery. A What's a Gloom is a game of misfortune. Each of us has chosen a family to tell the story of, to represent in this game. With our hand of cards, we will be trying to play uh, negative modifiers to our own cards to make our family the most tragic, the most unfortunate, and then murder them. Mm. We want to kill them off, that is the goal, but we want to kill them off before anyone else at the table can try and make our story a little bit better. Hey, mm. Damien, what's your family? Ah, yes, uh, welcome to the Dark Carnival, related not by blood of our own. <laughs> Mine are going by the Starks, of course, and um, my family can be a little bit violent. Hello. <laughs> so let me introduce you to the Wellington Smythe family. <laughs> In my family, a family of eccentric, evil inventors. You all play this game? I would love to. Let's oh, do it. Just a disclaimer, y'all. This is like this is like my favorite game. Would yeah. you start us off? Oh, I would love to. Here you start us off. On your turn, you can play two event cards at once, and if you choose to kill someone in your own family, that has to be your first turn. So I will not be doing that. But we all know, Mister. Giggles the clown, ah, the creepy clown with a skull for a face. One time, Mr. Giggles was a bit late returning oh. from their weekend trip because they were trapped oh, no. on a train. Oh. That's right. I know not where they went, but Mr. Giggles was forever changed afterwards. In addition, Mr. Giggles, surrounded by rumors, <gasps> Word travels fast, as does the sorry. circus. Yeah, sorry, I've been oh, spreading yes, a lot of traveling. things. You scandal lady. Uh, Mr. Giggles was scarred by scandals. Oh. And uh, my special thing from that is discarding my entire hand. Oh. But it being the end of my turn, I'm able to draw back up to five, and we are good oh. to go. Oh. Oh, clever, all right. Smart man. Well, mm. you've all. Met cousin Mordecai. Uh, tell me he's okay. He gives me weird <laughs> eyes. Cousin Mordecai ventured barefoot into the forest yeah. to collect sticks for his collection of sticks. <laughs> uh, yes. He went to grab at a stick and cousin Mordecai was startled by snakes. Oh, oh. Dios mio. Oh, dear heavens. He reached down for one only to realize that it was a poisonous snake of a name I know because I can name snakes. Or oh. name eight. <laughs> Name eight. Viper. Prove it. Oh God. We're gatekeeping snakes Rattle. here. <laughs> <laughs> Six others. Wow. Black mamba. California king snake. Cotton <sighs> mouth. Willem, mm -hmm. the handyman of the family, picked up a small hand mirror, ah. but unfortunately it was deeply haunted. Oh. <laughs> he brought it home out of vanity. And what it was a nearly stupid addicted to the way. You're right! <laughs> Willem Stark was a stupid little sh and yeah. he brought it home, and now he's being pestered by Pulse of Dice. Oh, oh, no! And with that, I give two cards of my choice from my hand to the player on my right. Oh, thank God. And then I draw back up. <laughs> <laughs> Dearest Damien, Duh. Mr. Giggles, whoa, what a sad tale. I had it in my mind to stage a little picnic to brighten that poor clown's spirit. Oh. I'm going to play this card that turns your negatives into a, a positive. You oh, bitch! <laughs> it covers all of your negative. <laughs> Mayhaps you have heard of the twins? I suck. swear if you show me your balls again, I'm going to be so pissed. <laughs> Mayhaps you may have heard of the twins. Remember how quiet he was earlier? 
<laughs> I like this way better. The twins love cheese. Nothing brings them more joy than to have a nice wheel of cheese. Of course. However, not only is the house plagued with cheese, but it is also plagued with mice. And those mice found the cheese. And they found the cheese within the children. <gasps> they were menaced by mice. And they get a negative 15. Yes. Really All did. the card says was menaced by mice. Yes. That's D it. Don't keep loose cheese in your stomach. Beware. Beware. The tale of the Slogar family, which I am closely related. Oh. No. And I will now tell you of the gloomy, painful life that was the life of Elias Igor. <gasps> no. Oh. No, I loved Elias. He was the best one. Trust me, oh. I know. <laughs> yeah. Elias was pierced no. by the porcupines. Uh, the pines. No. Heavens, the porcupines, no. pines. Yes, the pines. Oh no. And ever since then, uh, he's needed to use Neosporin daily. More evil is to come as I oh. discard my hand in exchange for new cards. Ooh. Oh yeah, I heard about your whole um, pestered by poltergeist things. You ever do the telephone game where you're like, Noah eats cheese, and they're like, Noah's a bunch of bees, and it's that kind of thing. This was all just a misunderstanding. Your Willem Stark had a picnic in the park, and my clownman uh, was pestered by Poltergeese. <gasps> Clown sat again. Everybody knows Thumbelisa, the tiny dancer yes. of the circus. Enchanting all who come to see her, if they squint hard enough. It's very difficult to find little, little tiny baby shoes, so she has to dance barefooted. So she suffered from sores. <gasps> oh, her toesies hurt. <clears throat> um, owie, oops. What, Sage? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Gickles? What about him? <laughs> the bishop is in town. <laughs> Don't you make that face at me right now. <laughs> Please, no. Uh, so I sent the bishop. Mr. Giggles has been blessed by the bishop. Uh. Willem Stark, as you know, Bleh. had a picnic in the park. Mm. He had a lovely day. Maybe his first lovely day in a long time. Only to be beaten by beggars. No. Oh, oh heavens. I always knew the poor were dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> when will people read The Giving Tree as a cautionary tale? <laughs> the nanny, my nanny, Franz Rusher, she mm. happened by that horrible sight. The picnic leftovers <gasps> left to spoil and rot on the ground. <laughs> This is my favorite Ian. Yeah. <laughs> but then she saw some of that good, good pudding <laughs> that was on the ground. And she thought, why not Why not just pick some up with mine hands? She was perturbed <laughs> by the pudding. <laughs> you see, it was a dark and stormy night. And that's the whole story. I draw four cards, then play any one card, including an untimely death as a free play. Damn, son. The twins. God, the, the twins, twins. doing it. As young as they may look, they were actually very old. They were trapped in children's bodies, an experiment of the mad scientist. Wow. Yes, 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 yes. One day, whoopsie poopsie, they just dead. Whoa. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to draw up to my curly room. How did that just okay. become that, the, that the Gersperms meme? <laughs> Gersperms. <laughs> By uh, lack of care of the container, Lord Slogar's brain in a box slowly contracted consumption. <gasps> yes. And in her sadness, Professor Helena Slogar, who was once married to Lord Slogar, turned to nothing but the bottle. <gasps> and she was ruined by rum. Oh. Yes. Yeah. What a bummer sauce. Uh, this clown! What a life they've had! So difficult! Uh, they had to turn to a life of crime. Stole from a stiff. Did they get cursed? Yes, they were cursed to smell like delicious French meats. And who would chase them for smelling like French meats but poodles? Thank you, for, thank you. They were pursued by poodles. It's flipping crazy. Wow. Very impressive. Uh, who's that? This is uh, Professor Helena Slogar. <gasps> she visited the lake and met a special, special woman. Ooh. Oh my goodness. She found love by the lake. Ooh. That oh. is a hopeless place. That is a moist woman. Wow. <laughs> <You're> Why? 
Gross. Balthazar. None here. Uh. The dog of the family. Yes, 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 yes. Ate one of the neighborhood children. Oh, I hate that dog. Uh, I the whole oh, neighborhood I, hates that dog me. now. Balthazar. Balthazar has been shunned by society. Uh, shunned. Uh, and with that, I discard my entire hand and skip my draw face. Uh, so that's wow. uh, spicy. Let me tell you the story. All about oh, how my life I've got twisted. Upside face. down. Let me tell you about my brother, Mr. Butterfield. Ah, do it. Please. Tigers love the taste of butler. <laughs> oh, come my on. brother Very close. is a butler. Right, and he yet. was taunted by daggers. No. Oh. Yes, poor little Lord Wellington Smythe. He went rolling down the hill as he does. That's his favorite pastime. Oh, yes. That's what that is. Yes, <laughs> unfortunately, a bunch of ground wasps had made a nest. He rolled over them. He was wounded by wasps. Ah, oh, ah. Yes, <laughs> yes. Willem Stark, unfortunately, <laughs> took quite a fart. And this fart was so gaseous that the only lantern lighting the outhouse, unfortunately, combusted. Oh, no. Meaning Willem Stark was badly burned, so badly burned, they passed. Oh, oh no. Everything. Shameful death. They have died. As well, Lord Wellington Smythe, of course, he was stung by ground whilst rolled around, was allergic. So allergic that they passed out. For the first time in many years, they slept without sorrows. It was a great nap. In fact, so good it made them totally not even remember that they were stung by wasps, returning their negative feeling to a positive one. Wow. Mm. What an inspiring tale. You guys remember the clown I won't shut the hell up about? Oh, we oh. do. <laughs> Are you still on about the clown? I clowns. Very misunderstood. I actually, real life, Damien, I love clowns because they're misunderstood. They're there to make you happy, but people get scared of them. It's very sad. I do love clowns. But unfortunately, someone has an opposite feeling of clowns. <gasps> they so loathe them. They push dear Mr. Giggles down the stairs. And Mr. Giggles is no more. It's about oh. time. <laughs> you son of a bitch, it was you! Me, <laughs> me. <laughs> <laughs> was his last giggle? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it was. Ah, oh, the dog, Balthazar. Sucks. But every dog <laughs> he was. Sucks has his day. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> he did that dog sucks at it twice. You know what? That dog set up a butt sucking booth. <laughs> a booth <laughs> for it. And for one carnival ticket, no. just one carnival ticket, you no. could go on down and get your butt sucked by a dog. No. <laughs> so this dog was the toast of the town. <laughs> oh! I think for this turn, I can just draw. I don't think I can do anything because I discarded my entire hand that's last true. time. Yeah. So yeah. that's it for me. Up is the end of your turn. Yup. <laughs> Mr. Butterfield. Sure. He heard about this butt sucking dog. Uh, no, and we he, can't edit it out. We can't edit it out no, if it's two turns. He was delighted to try it. Okay. So he asked the man at the corner of the street, where's this dog? However, he thought he asked where the bog was. He went looking for that butt-sucking dog, but instead he found a human-sucking bog! Oh, no. What? And he perished oh. in a Bog. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sucks. Rumor is that someone has landed themselves a legacy for the deeds that have happened to them, and that person is named. Um, what's their name? Oh my God, cousin Mordecai. Cousin Mordecai. There is a little limerick being said about them at the local pub. It goes something like, Cousin Mordecai, Cousin Mordecai, I love the look in your eyes. It's very loving, it's quick, it's simple, and everyone yes. loves it. Thumbelisa, the tiniest of all dancers. That girl smelled like berries. Um, <laughs> and uh, you, you know who likes berries a lot? Bears. Um, so a bunch of bears just came up and they just went squamp. And they gobbled her up. <gasps> Rip in oh, peace. No. <laughs> Who's that lady at the very bottom there? Oh, uh, that's your mom. <laughs> <laughs> She's the nanny. The nanny? She's Fran Dresch. Fran Dresch is very clever at cards. So take this plus 15, put it on her, and draw one card. Balthazar <laughs> broke many bones. Oh, oh no. no. I would not dare ask Balthazar TMI. for the details, but from what I can gather, <laughs> it is horrifying. 
Do you think he tried to do two butts at once? <laughs> <laughs> the Dutchman's double is not to be attempted by an amateur. <laughs> Give me the cat dog. Look, cat <laughs> dog. I wouldn't say he failed, but I would say he paid a great price. For, uh, yeah. for this card, I choose one living character and discard its top modifier card, Lord Wellington Smythe. That nap was actually a coma <gasps> brought on by the wasps. So he woke up and he felt bad. <laughs> oh so I'm removing this modifier card. Oh. Let me continue the tale of the Slogar family. For when we last left off, Lord Slogar had contracted consumption. Well, being just a brain in a box, you know what happened next. He choked on a bone. <gasps> yes. Literally. This led to Lord Slogar's untimely death. And unfortunately at the funeral, they uh, needed extra hands, so they hired a bunch of sick plague victims. No. Oh, yes, which led to Melissa Slogar contracting the pox. No. <gasps> yes, she is now plagued with the pox. Oh. That little, that weird little girl you have, I believe in her. I give her a chance to begin again by discarding all of her modifier cards. Oh. She is cured! You have been absolved, child. There's something in the town that seems to be stirring. It seems like we have tapped into the root of all evil. I will be drawing one card from each of your hands. Oh no. <laughs> that one. You get nothing. Oh man, you really. <laughs> that one. And because I control a card that has the money icon on it, I can play uh, any number of these that I want. Damn. Oh. The old dam. She fell down into the well. And with that, I will play an immediate death and unfortunately died of the means of she obtained in that well. We're sick of everything that Balthazar has been put through. He's sucked far too many butts. One of the neighbors mistook him for a lump of apples and baked him into a pie. Oh, oh heavens! Asses to asses. Butts to butts. <laughs> butts to butts. Asses to asses, butts to butts. <laughs> I have good news about Melissa Slogan. Good news, everyone. Just scrolling through her Bumble profile, I came across a very striking lad. And the next day, they were married, the yearned. Oh, Whoa. So you, you, I must tell must? you about Lord Wellington. Yes. He perished. <gasps> Shablon. There was so much confusion around Angel's place in this world. Well, she got the attention of the mob. Oh. They burnt her. Oh, oh, my mob does. dear Angel has oh. been burnt by oh, the like, mob. Like a uh, rich fox. Sorry, very quickly. You like Sonic. You like Sonic. <laughs> Sonic says, there's no such thing as ethical consumption under capitalism. Whoa! Sonic uh, says prison labor is slave labor. <laughs> Stay woke, kids. Uh, a tragic <laughs> misunderstanding has happened in our history. The person who was clever at cards was really Darius Dark. It would be. And really, the nanny is the one who was starved in a store. Oh, oh, my God. Look at that. No one would ever know. Best news you're gonna hear all day. Remember that piece of garbage, a little boy that we hate? He's not even real. What? He's an imaginary friend. Choose one living character from a family of, family of your choice, remove it from the game, then remove this card from the game, which means Whoa. that we have finally a family of all dead folks. Uh, wow. So tally up your scores. And, and it's only the dead ones? Only the dead. Only the only dead count towards your dead? scores. Yes. Uh, I am at a total of negative 50 bloom. I'm at negative 110. 70. 70. I am at negative 90, which means I win. In reality, in a much more real way, the Circus of the Dam brings home another trophy. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us for Board AF, everybody. Congrats to Damien for being the saddest of sad boys. Congratulations, you sad little S bitch. Saddest boy there's <laughs> ever been. Whatever. Uh, no don't, me. Uh, don't tell anyone about the dog butt sucking thing. We beg of you, but do click over here if you want to see another video. <gasps> And click over there if you'd like to see another video. Oh, How that's so gloomy. Wow. Don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell if you want to see more of this and get a notification every time we post. And I don't know, get some merch or something and come back next it's time. Smash.com slash go. Check us out live on Twitch. Thanks, friends. <laughs> Miss you.